As spring takes hold across California, the snowpack numbers don't look good for either of San Diego County's main sources of water, the Sierra Nevada and the Rocky Mountains. Let's start with the State Water Project, which relies on the Sierra snowpack to slowly melt over the spring and summer, supplying the lowlands from the Central Valley to San Diego. State officials have recently reduced projected water deliveries from the project to just 35 percent of the full allocation, primarily due to record dry months in January and February. In addition, concern about endangered fish in the Sacramento-San Joaquin Bay Delta limited pumping from the Delta by more than 550,000 acre feet this winter. As of late March, the statewide amount of water in the snowpack was just 52% of average and runoff was tracking well below average as well. The situation is similar in the Colorado River Basin where the snowpack is about 80% of normal. Water stored in Lake Mead has fallen by about 5 million acre feet over the past year and inflow into Lake Powell is among the lowest in recent decades. It's also been dry right here in San Diego County where precipitation is about 70% of normal at Lindbergh Field and just 56% of normal in Ramona. The National Drought Monitor shows drought conditions are likely to develop in coastal Southern California. And across most of the West, drought conditions are likely to persist or even intensify. So where does that leave us as we move towards summer? Thanks to bountiful runoff two years ago, there's still plenty of water stored in reservoirs for Southern California. No watering restrictions are anticipated this year. But stay tuned for more updates as the situation changes. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.